it's no secret that being a professional basketball player pays pretty well. So today we are going to show you inside of Tristan Thompson's $7.9 million mansion. Before we dive into today's video, it has come to our attention that 96% of you guys who watch our videos are not subscribed. So if everyone watching this video could hit that subscribe button, help us get to our goal of 100,000 subscribers, that would be much appreciated. Tristan Thompson's $7.9 million mansion is located in Encino, California. Normally we do not release the address or town of the homes we are featuring out of an abundance of safety for those who live in them. However, Tristan Thompson doesn't currently live in the home and it actually is listed for sale. So if you're interested in snagging up the home of an NBA star, now is your chance. The nearly $8 million home has stood on nearly half an acre of land with a stunning backyard space. The home was built in 2018 and Tristan purchased the home in May of 2019 for $6.5 million. He later listed the property in July of 2020 amid his move to the East Coast where he currently plays basketball for the Boston Celtics. The property was originally listed for $8.5 million and was recently dropped down to $7.9 million in an effort to find a new owner. So if you have roughly $8 million laying around and are looking for a new home, this may just be the one. But the cost of ownership won't stop at the staggering purchase price. The new owner can expect to pay roughly $80,000 per year in property taxes and an additional $35,000 per year in homeowner's insurance. But I'm pretty sure whoever buys this amazing home won't bat an eye at the nearly $115,000 per year in basic homeownership costs. The home is a seven bedroom and eight bathroom with 9,864 square feet of living space, breaking down to about $801 per square foot. As you enter the home's motor court, you have a three car garage located off to the left. Stepping to the right and through the front door as you enter into the main foyer, which has a formal dining room directly to your left. Outfitted with a custom chandelier hanging from above, it's the perfect place to enjoy a family meal. Off to the right side of the entranceway, you pass by the stairs to the second floor and carry over into the formal living room, perfect for when you have some guests over and don't want to enter into the main living space of the home. Home. As you make your way deeper into the home, you pass by the home's wine cellar and home's custom movie theater. Then farther down the hall, you find the home's gourmet kitchen. The kitchen features black stone countertops with white painted cabinets and top of the line appliances. The golden fixtures add a nice touch to the space and give it a modern touch. Adjacent to the kitchen is the family living room, which features a gas fireplace and a wall of sliding glass doors that leads out to the backyard. Stepping out into the backyard, you'll find a large grass area with a spacious pool in the center of the yard with an attached hot tub. There's a sitting area with a gas fire pit at the back of the yard and an outdoor barbecue area off to the edge of the yard. There is a two bedroom and one bathroom pool house at the back of the yard that offers nearly 1600 square feet of living space. Can you imagine literally having a pool house that is larger than most people's entire homes? Back inside and moving upstairs you'll find the master suite which offers a gas fireplace perfect for setting a mood on a late night. Around the corner you'll find his and hers bathrooms and I literally mean a separate bathroom for him and a separate bathroom for her which blows my mind. Her bathroom is covered with marble as far as the eye can see with a glass walk-in shower and a large freestanding soaking tub. Off her bathroom is a walk-in closet with white painted cabinets and a center island. Moving into his bathroom, you have contrasting dark stone and moving into his closet, you have black painted cabinets. Off the master suite, you have a private balcony that overlooks the backyard. The remaining bedrooms upstairs come with their own ensuite bathrooms as you would expect in a nearly $8 million house. But honestly, that pretty much wraps up our tour of Tristan Thompson's $7.9 million mansion. I would love to hear what your favorite part is about the $7.9 million house by leaving it down in the comment section down below. As well, if you had $7.9 million laying around, is this a home you'd purchase? That wraps up today's video. If you guys enjoyed, make sure to hit that subscribe button and follow us on all of our social media accounts located in the description. Thanks for watching and we'll see you next time.